Hello and welcome again to Shep Rambles where I am Shep and I tend to ramble about what? Anything and everything. And we're going to go right back to Sims 4 again and we're going to talk about uh, the Seasons expansion pack because I'm actually looking forward to it even though I don't have Sims 4 at least yet. I am hoping that they do this season's expansion pack right not like the cats and dogs thing where that's all they had and they didn't bother adding all the pets that they had in sims 3 they they need to do this right not just not just do it halfway they need to go all the way and and push it even further than what it was in sims 3 and it's beginning to look like that like they're adding thermostats inside of a house where you control the temperature so that's that's cool but the big thing is that you'll be able to I mean you had holidays in Sims 3 but you'll be able to make your own holidays so there is a new trailer holidays uh, official gameplay trailer that we're gonna check out I haven't seen it yet, so we'll check this out and we'll kind of analyze it a little bit, and uh, we'll go from there. So let me just uh, take off our graphic here. Let's do this. Celebrate heartfelt holiday traditions and enjoy new seasonal activities in the Sims 4 Seasons Expansion Pack. Snow, fun, and presents. Winter is the most magical time of the year. Let's decorate for Winterfest. Like real life, holidays are filled with traditions. Taking part in these activities will earn your Sims satisfaction points to unlock rewards, including new traits like ice proof. Brr. Merry Winterfest. It's present time. Ugh, gross. A half eaten pizza. Don't worry, Father Winter has brought some cheer. <laughs> As winter fades, spring blossoms, and Mateo's got a hot date for Love Day. That'd be this rain cool if that calendar is actually in Sims problem. 4. With the weather controller, you can choose the weather that's right for you. Love Day is the perfect holiday to show that special someone how much you care. A skilled gardener can now arrange the perfect bouquet. Taking your sim sweetheart out is a love day tradition. And without question, Mateo's got some dating games. I like the skating rink. That looks a lot better than what they had in game. Sims 3. The summer sun is high and Keiko deserves a day off. In seasons, you can even create your own holidays. Yep, here Pick we go. a day and choose traditions. Water fun, invite guests, and who doesn't love a cookout? The grill is smoking and the water's cool. Keiko should celebrate this holiday every year. The leaves are falling. It's sweater weather. Let's celebrate Harvest Fest. The grand meal is the day's oldest tradition. And Anthony's in charge of dessert. He just needs one final ingredient. Honey. Let's hope there are leftovers. Ah, Harvest Fest. A time for family, appreciation, <laughs> and fire. So not Thanksgiving, Fortunately, Harvest these Fest. these two skipped the main course and went right to dessert. In the Sims 4 Seasons Expansion Pack, experience impactful weather, revel in seasonal activities, and celebrate heartfelt holidays. Alrighty, so pretty cool. Uh, there's a, st uh, they're reusing a lot of footage from the Sims 4 uh, Seasons, and they are really hyping this up, you can tell. Um, so let's take a look here. So we've got, we've got the, the rain here. Let's go mute this here. So we're not, uh, having to hear that audio again. Let's go back here. So you got snow, got rain, and there's, uh, the change of color. It looks like we've got the Easter bunny. Is it me or does this bunny head look? 
familiar, like something else, like from a anime or something. I don't know. Uh, this, you know, what this reminds me of this reminds me of the festivals and stuff that is in season three, seasons three, Sims three. Um, so I hope they're they're doing that. Uh, they got the Easter egg, so. They had the uh, the Easter egg hunt and stuff like that in uh, Sims 3. I forget what they called it. And, oh, wait a minute. Go back to this uh, skating rink here. That's what I thought. I think they have different looking skating rinks. Because the one that we saw before is definitely different than this one. Because uh, Sims 3, they only had, like, one, right? They only had... Uh, one type just like the ice skating rink i think was just one type so it looks like you got more to choose from here so that's kind of cool okay so they kind of changed things around here you got the summer thing you got a, a summer booth um pool barbecue big pail uh, nice big logo here. All right, got some playground equipment back here. Um, I haven't been playing The Sims 4, so I don't know if this is new um, or not. Maybe you could tell me. Got another booth here. Um, uh, looks like a picture, Apple, or something like that. Okay, and then there's our ice skating rink. I like how these little uh, things change color. It's kind of neat. We have another booth here. Okay, so playing in the snow, building snow, or a bit building snowmen. Um, it looks like you can also make uh, different types of snowmen. Okay, snow angels, that's nothing new. I've been doing that since Sims 2. Um, now, you know what I'm curious about is if this is all rendered footage or if this is actual in game footage. Okay, so we've got pretty nice house here. Oh, man, I really wish it was open world. I really wish Sims 4 was open world. Um, okay, so we got Christmas lights. And some decorations around the windows. Um... Decorations, I guess. Oh, this is kind of cool. Pick these things up at Walmart. <laughs> Storage containers. Okay, so we got some decorating. Most likely these are a lot of decorating uh, things you can't really interact with. I, I like the big uh, nutcracker. My father-in-law, he loves nutcrackers. I think he's got one that's this, this big too. I love the fireplace. That's that's pretty neat. Okay, so he there's another one there. <clears throat> okay, so we got Winterfest. Some decorations. Whoa, let's go back here. Let's take a look at these uh Okay, so rewards, cold acclimation, heat, waterproof, storm chaser, a night owl, ice proof, heat proof. Be nice if we could, I guess we can kind of guess what these might be, like night owl might be like you don't need as much sleep. I think these are pretty obvious. <clears throat> Yeah, we know she doesn't get affected. Okay, so random presents. You know what's funny is on this picture here, she's like smiling. Thumbs down, man, I'm smiling. What else do we have in here? We've got some, I don't know, looks like a dunce cap or something. 
winter what father winter <laughs> what's this I wonder what this is just some storage cabinet okay another another random present I like the little children's drawings that's cool and then the calendar okay all right so this has got the days of the week sims 3 had that and sims 2 had that also if i'm not mistaken it's been a while since i played it so i'm wondering it's like i want to scroll down and i forget this is a video so i'm wondering if you can set up your i wonder if it's going to have a calendar and you can set up on your calendar different types of things and that way it'll man that'll be sweet if it's like that now see this is something that would be a, a huge improvement over sims 3 is an actual calendar i wonder how far in advance you could set it maybe a month or two or something because see it doesn't have days you know but this could just be uh just for this video so who knows did we miss anything here? There's like some playground equipment. Got well, those little puzzle ground things. Okay, there's that. Swings. I don't really see anything else interesting. Rain jacket. Meow. Yeah, the umbrellas. That's nothing new. Okay, the weather machine. That's nothing new. Okay. Um, got some stuff here too. A little place to put shoes, although I'm sure that's decoration. Uh, dinner. See, now I don't know if this is an animation or if this is what works with uh, one of those expansion packs. What was it? Get Out? Was that the one that had the... Um, the restaurants okay so then we got the botanist uh, the gardening thing I remember this being able to make plants and give them I think that I think that was Sims 3 okay so see here's that different skating rink maybe the skating rink depends upon what season it is too because, like, see, this is the one that's during the springtime with uh, April. Of course, you got your music. There's the guy with the raincoat. <laughs> like, I like the old... Do you think they're going to have roller blades? Or do you think they're just going to be roller skates? Now here's, why can't they have like roller skates, uh, well it's not an open world so I guess this doesn't matter, but wouldn't it be cool if you could like roller skate across town instead of just inside of a, a rink? And skateboards. I did, did Sims 3 have skateboards? Or was it just a motorcycle? It was probably just motorcycles. Okay, all right, cow plant, but I think that was already brought back into Sims 4. Okay, so here we go, adding a holiday. So it looks like, okay, you can choose if it's a day off from work. Um, I'm guessing this is a, just, it's like an icon or, you know, something that you can associate to whatever your holiday is going to be. You've got a decoration here. Um, and then new traditions. Uh, we're not going to see what they all are. There, apparently there's a big list here. Maybe some mods will allow you to add some others here. Clean. Can you imagine a, a cleaning holiday? A holiday where you have to barbecue, clean, decorate, and air grievances. I'm get for a moment. 
I, I'm guessing what that means is you you got to shout out the things that you're upset about. Like cleaning. As you're counting down to midnight. <laughs> this has got a lot of possibilities. This has got a lot of possibilities. Okay, she sees. Okay, so by the looks of it, it looks like you can probably add about five. Okay, we got a little kiddie pool, picnic basket. I I dug so the water hose up here on the wall. That's cool. I don't think we've seen that before. It's just decoration, but that adds a nice little touch. All right, fall. Something down here. Oh, that's the scarecrow. What was that one guy? Oh, huh. What is he doing? He's like a uh, leaf blower. I think that's new. I don't think we had a leaf blower before. Okay, there is... There was some cooking or something here just a moment ago. All right. Not too much to really. Okay, this is the bees, the birds and the bees. Okay, ringing a bell. Okay, so we got the whole buffet thing going. No, no, sorry, not the buffet. The whole uh, big banquet. Banquet. I knew it started with a B. Now, you know what would be cool? I I'm sure this is not the case, but if you could set it up, you know, where you select a sim and it's like, hey, pass me the fish or, you know, and they could like pass it around the table. That'd be cool. Uh, I'd like to be a hot dog man. Big some big shrimp. Thought she was gonna puke over the table. Yeah, we've seen that before. Okay, chairs. LGR will be happy about these chairs. You know how he loves chairs. Lazy game reviewer, in case you're wondering. Go check out his stuff, LGR. He does a lot of sim stuff. He's awesome. Streaker has been done before. A life-size gnome, that's just scary. I thought that was Jack Skellington at first. Do they have trick or treating? That that's a that was a cool thing in Sims 3. Of course, you know, that was the open world going around and doing trick or treating. So who knows if that that'll be available here in Sims 4 or not. And that's it. All right. So That is the trailer for the holidays uh, coming on June 22nd. So I'm not going to be pre-ordering it. Um, I've learned my lesson on pre-orders that <laughs> things are so disappointing. You get so hyped up on something and then you're like, Arr. but uh, yeah, just... Uh, Music courtesy of Audio Network. Sorry. I'm just looking at a different screen than what you're looking at. Um, yeah, kind of looking forward to seeing some reviews. Um, definitely looking forward to LGR's review. He always does the best, most honest reviews when it comes to uh, Sims games. So... I trust what he's got to say. So we'll see what he says, and then I'll just go from there if I want to get Sims 4 and Seasons.
for that matter. Well, I uh, appreciate you checking this out. Um, let me know in the comments what you think. If um, you're interested in seasons, if you're hyped up, you're looking forward to it, or is this just old news, like we've been there, done that, and you've kind of moved on, or maybe you're maybe you're sticking with Sims 3 because you just like it better. Um, <clears throat> Sims 3 is actually, I, I love Sims 3, and if you put it on a solid state drive, you can get some great performance out of it. You're not going to sit there and wait for 10 minutes for everything to load. I've got Sims 3 and everything installed on it, and it doesn't take very long for it to come up at all. So maybe I'll do a video just so I can show you guys that it doesn't take long. But anyway, appreciate you checking things out. Um, remember, like, subscribe. You know, those are options. Those are things. And until that, yeah, until that, until that, until then, I, I'll see you on the next video.